All right, today I have the pleasure of talking to a very special guest. Want to know who? Stay tuned. Wonderful cat crazy friends. I hope your week is going great. Welcome to my cat crazy channel where it's all about cats. So if you like cats, please hit the subscribe button below and tap the notification bell and you'll be notified when there is a new video. And now it's time for the quiz of the day. Oh. Towser, a Guinness world record cat caught how many mice? 365, 599, 1440, or 28,899. So today we're talking to the original keyboard player of the band, yes, and cat lover Tony K. You have met him, haven't you, you guys? Yes, you have. Hey Tony, thank you so much for talking with me on my Cat Crazy channel today. That's my cat pleasure. Cat pleasure, all right. Well, since we're already talking cat, you have a cat called Monkey. How did you get him? Well, we got him at um, a uh, cat uh, adoption uh, at Petco. And uh, we went there and he, he looked at us and, uh, and that was it, we took him. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and I remember he was a little bit aggressive in the beginning, so what did you do to tame this little guy? You know, he was a little guy and uh, he, was, he was like a flying monkey. That's <laughs> why I actually was called a monkey, because he used to fly, fly yes. everywhere. And yes, he, he was a little wild. He was, he was a crazy monkey. We called him Monkey. Yeah. So you recently moved cross country, which can be quite the undertaking when you have a pet, especially when it takes more than a day. So how did that go? Well, it actually was um, a lot easier than, uh, than we thought. Um, we, uh, we had an SUV, we put the seats down, and we made a home for him in the, in the back of the SUV. And he was, he was quite happy. And until I accidentally um, hit a switch that turned the heat on in the back. I didn't know that the heat was on and he started meowing continually. And we thought that, you know, he was just, I don't know, complaining or wanted food or whatever. And um, <laughs> it was only when I sort of popped my head in the, in the, around the seats in the back that I, I discovered that it was Hot. about 100. 120 degrees. Oh my god. That and he was nice. he was not happy. Oi oi oi. All right. So my next question is, uh, what would you do differently apart from the heating part? Is there anything you would do different if you would do something like that again? No, actually um, we did it we did it right. Um, uh, he was actually pretty good. I'm not sure that I'd I'd want to do it with um, Two or three dogs, but uh, but one little kitty um, was actually good. And we stayed at, at pet-friendly hotels that were, you know, perfect. Um, we, you know, with animals, and uh, and it was it was quite easy. Um, he had a better time than we did. So, does Monkey like his new home? He loves his new home. Uh -huh. Yes, he's, he has a lot of room to play in, and he can. Um, he can go in the garden. Um, I built a security fence all the way around the garden, which was my first uh, priority here because um, we knew that he wanted to uh, be outside a lot. And um, we actually uh, went to uh, Key West and went to the Hemingway House, where of course there are, uh, I think, 46 cats now. And they did the same thing. They built um, a sort of uh, fence um, around the entire property to keep the cats in. And I kind of copied the idea and did it, uh, did it at our house. And it's worked really well. 
Well, he has a wonderful life. He does. He 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 loves it here. Oh. Well, Tony, thank you so much for talking with me today. We all miss you guys and the Monkey Men here a lot. I know we miss you too. But <laughs> we we watch your show and um, I love you. it. Thank and, you. Um, and and so does Monkey. Great. Yeah, it's a cat TV. Yeah. <laughs> well, thank, thank you. you so much. Okay. <laughs> okay. My pleasure, Peter. Bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> well, of course. Nowadays, some people are suggesting CBDs uh, that are specifically made for pets to help with anxiety and calm them down in case of travel or whatever is going on. The only problem with that is that the CBD market is still relatively new and not yet well regulated or third party tested for safety. So it might be a bit difficult for consumers to know exactly what they're buying. So I would suggest definitely talk to your vet before you do this. So what do you think about CBDs for cats? CBD, CBD seems to be great for everybody and everything. Okay. <laughs> um, the, I would say the, my reservation as a veterinarian is we don't have a lot of studies, like established data, to say what concentration and what dose to treat which ailment. Right. And so it's very hard to recommend CBD um, because there's so many different formulations of different concentrations, the oils and things that they can be mixed with. And some cats can cause GI upset um, or you know just cause them to not feel well. It could taste bad, which we don't, mm -hmm. once you give them something that tastes bad once, oh, yeah, you're yeah, kind yeah. of done with that forever. Yes. Um, and so certainly uh, I have a lot of clients that kind of experiment with CBD in a number of uh, for a number of reasons. Mm -hmm. um, it seems to work well for them <laughs> and their cats. But right now, I'm still waiting for the research to come out to say, Dr. Anderson, this is what you give for what, and this is the dose, and this is what we can expect. And I, so the universities are working on some of those that data for us, so we should have it in a few years. All right, nice. yeah. awesome. Thank you so much. There you have it. And the answer is 28,899 mice. Towser the Mauser was a long-haired tortoiseshell cat born in 1963 and lived a happy and long life in a distillery in Scotland. Uh, she was famous for her record-breaking mouse catching skills which made it to the Guinness Book of Records as the world best mouser uh, with a solid count of 28,899 mice during her 24 years on this planet. This is it for today and I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel. Uh, if you'd like to check out a couple of the available natural cat tranquilizers um, that we talked about just hit show more below or visit my web uh, website catcrazychannel.com for more info. Thanks so much for watching and I hope to see you again next week. Bye bye!